Welcome to InDesign. In this segment, we'll take a look at the page palette. The page palette is where you can control your master pages for your document. You can add and delete pages, duplicate pages and their content, and reorder the pagination. The page palette can be found in a palettes menu on the right or under the Windows tab in the main menu. Here we have a single page document. Let's look at adding pages. Coming up to the flyout menu, you'll see insert pages. This calls a dialog box, which offers a lot of flexibility. We can add multiple pages at once. We can specify where those pages appear, either before or after a specific page, or at the beginning or end of a document. You can also apply specific master pages to the pages you're about to add. Clicking OK, you notice that the page palette updates from a single page to a four page document. Let's take a look at a second way of adding pages. Let's first give our document some reference. And in this magenta cube, you notice it updates and page two now has, has some content. Let's click on page one, selecting that, and coming down to the new page icon. Clicking that once will add a single page after your page you've selected. The document is updated and you see that page two is now page three and we have a new page two. Let's come up to another document. Now let's talk about duplicating, reordering, and deleting pages. To duplicate pages, simply select your page or pages by holding the shift key down, dragging and dropping over the new page icon, and you'll notice that InDesign has updated the page palette to reflect two additional pages with their content page five and page six. To reorder the pagination, click and drag anywhere in the page palette and you'll see the vertical line indicating where those pages will, will be placed, either between pages, before or after any page. To delete pages, select your pages you want deleted, click the trash can, or you can drag and drop over the trash can. Hope this segment helped.